Welcome to the Simple Life, Home Setting the Pioneer Way. This is Brenda Weatherly. I just want to take a few minutes to do a short video. As you know, I, I do a lot of short videos. I don't have time to do uh, long videos. And besides, um, I like short videos. You don't have to hold anybody's attention for long. As you can see, I'm barefoot. I go barefoot most of the time. We in the South uh, love to go barefoot. Um, as you know, we just went a couple of weeks ago to the Davy Crockett Days up in Lawrenceburg, Tennessee. And uh, I was looking for some moccasins uh, that were authentic to the 1700s um, of that era. And I could not find any that fit me because I have a small foot. Um, when you buy shoes that says small, medium, and large, I wear small. That's a five, six. Um, I have wore a four when I go to the shoe store to get something to fit me. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, I came home and I just traced my foot. And we cut out a pattern. And I am sewing my... Uh, this is the leather side. I bought this hide uh, at Lawrenceburg. And um, here's my... Uh, I didn't have an awl, or I've got an awl, but it was in the toolbox, so I just got an ice pick. And this is sinew. This is what they um, sewed with, the Indians. They didn't have thread, so they didn't uh, throw anything of the animal away, be it buffalo or deer or um, elk or whatever. And this is the sinew. Let me see if we can see that. I've got it wrapped on a bo popsicle stick. But this is sinew. And um, that's what they would have used in the 1700s to sew with. So that's what I'm sewing with. And uh, this is the leather side. And then when you turn it over, it's going to be the uh, suede side. And also, I have made a skirt. I've got it done except I like the hem. Um, as you can see, this is the leather side, which is the underneath side. That way, when this gets wet, you don't get wet. Um, they could get in water and, and get rained on everything, and it would be fine, even though this might be soaked. This is the side. The sides have fringe. The bottom has fringe. And um, the top will just be hemmed. So, as you can see, I've got all the fringe done. And all I like is hemming that. And that will be a new buckhide or a rawhide skirt. And so, uh, and also, uh, nowadays, uh, our moccasins have a sole, and they have a top part that's, uh, you know, around. But in the 1700s, this is where they were done. <clears throat> I can drop it in the floor. They just had a center seam. And let me show you the one that I have finished. <clears throat> right over here, I have finished this one, and I have got it turned right side out. As you can see, that's just a center seam, and this turns down to make the little top cuff. And let me show you what that looks like on, if I can do this with one hand. Let me see. I can't hardly see what I'm doing through this camera. <laughs> anyway get my tootsies in there and it's supposed to fit kind of tight because uh, it will kind of stretch as, as it goes and there's my little fringe at the back now this you turn down even at the back let's see if I can do that like I said it's kind of difficult doing things with one hand But anyway, there. 
me stand up. And you can see my new shoe. It's got the fringe on the back. So that's my moccasin. What do you guys think? I think I'm going to like it. And they're just like going barefooted, you guys. I mean, it really is just like going barefooted. So, here's the fringe to put on my other heel. And, um, I will be done just in a few minutes. And have, oh, I dropped it on the floor. Have a new pair of moccasins. Now, I have moccasins. But they go um, way up here, and they have like three sections of um, fringe, and that's just not authentic. So I need me an authentic pair for my reenacting. Sometimes I go as a pioneer, and sometimes I go as Indian. So I mean, I am Cherokee after all. And uh, as you've seen on the uh, YouTube, I was learning some Choctaw. Uh, excuse me, not Choctaw, but Chickasaw. Because we have Chickasaw in this area. And, um, so I wanted to learn some chicken saw, Chickasaw to, um, speak with the Chickasaw here in this area. So, till next time, this is Brenda Weatherly with A Simple Life, homesteading the pioneer way, saying, keep homesteading.